Hi, um, my name is Michiko Hammond. Um, I am the innkeeper for here at the Honomu Inn um, on the Big Island. This area of Honomu had actually a very lively history. From what I'm told, uh, this used to be kind of like Little Chicago where like, everybody came here to get a good drink or um, like our inn actually used to be uh, a brothel at one point, a bar at one point. Um, it used to be a gathering at one point. There used to be a building there. Um, they used to hold boxing matches on top of the building. So all the local people would go onto the top and just watch a bo boxing match. So it used to be a pretty rowdy place back in the day. And, and over the time, um, like I said, when this is closed, it's just become a very nice, quiet place now. Yes, it used to be a plantation town, sure came. When that plantation um, shut down, a lot of the locals came down and bought homes here. And actually, that's where my family comes in. Um, one of my, I think, my great-great-grandfather and grandmother who immigrated from Japan were plantation workers. And they um, decided to settle down here. And when they settled, behind this street, uh, there's, they bought, I believe, about eight eight houses or so. So it used to be funny because um, our family used to joke that used to be the Hanashiro Road because just all the Hanashiros <laughs> lived um, with, right next to each other. And then, of course, over time, the kids grew up and um, many of them left home. And But now and it's interesting enough that a lot of them are coming back. Um, the shop right here next to the inn, um, which is called Purple Eye, uh, is run by Annie. She's a lovely, lovely lady. Um, has wonderful, wonderful things. But her shop used to be a barber shop. And in that barber shop um, was by my great, great grandfather, I believe. And they used to call him the one arm barber man because he used to only have one arm. And he was used to attach like different, I guess, cutting to, I don't know. <laughs> but from what, yeah, like Edward Scissor's hand, right? And the inn here is six rooms, um, but one of the main bottom room is where I stay, which I'm the innkeeper. So, and then the five rooms upstairs is a queen bed, three are queen bedrooms, and then two of them are two twin bedrooms. And then, and then, yeah. And then each room features a key card um, system that will also power up your the ac and the water heater so it really helps we're eco-friendly um and we're also very kid friendly i myself have a little one she um, is staying with me too so we um, hope to furnish more um, like sofa couches and be able to provide guests um, at least about four four or five people could stay in the room and then we'll also have futons if people don't mind sleeping on futons <laughs> but we have really comfy futons um, the beginning of the lobby is old english traditional has beautiful um, wood moldings it has high tall ceilings um, a great use of the space um, and then upstairs is a contrast where it is white cottage um, everything is pretty much white um, but it's done tastefully, of course, and it's really homey and cozy. When I think of Hawaii, I think of Honolulu because, you know, everybody has aloha, everybody um, has, has the best interest for this town. So, yeah, that's what I think. <laughs>